pecan pie. Mm. All right, for this unboxing video, we got 8-Bitty Game Controller. Ooh, compatible with an eye crap. Um, it's a game controller, of course, you know. Works with the iPad crap, and of course, your phone. Oh, and, and, and robots. Yeah. Um, compatible with thousands of games. Awesome retro design. Two shoulder buttons. Oh my god. This sounds awesome and it's only 30 bucks. Bluetooth. Oh my god, let's 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 unbox this. Let's open this up because this is so epic. I'm so excited. Oh, cut the package. Put this pair of scissors. Okay, what do we got? I still can't get in the fucking packaging. Oh. Alright. All right, you get inside, you get inside a piece of fucking plastic, which you can use to wipe your ass with if you're into that kind of thing, because this up against your ass is a damn good ass wipe. All right, so we get um, some instructions, um, pretty much on how to use an iPhone, nothing on Android, useless. All right, let's see what we get here. Oh, God dang it. Get out of the package. All right, so 30 bucks, do I get any batteries in here? Hmm, check this out. You get a button there, and you know, so it feels like an old NES pad. Oh, this feels like total Chinese piece of shit. Where was this made? Made in China, go figure. All right, so we got some strange looking, you know, if you look at the NES controller, you get buttons like this. But no, they're like square. Feels kinda kinda cheap. Of course the FCC wants you to know that uh, this complies with 15 parts of it. If there's more than one 15 parts. As you can see, it's got this cool sticker. This really cool wooden sticker on it. Of course you get a power button, on or off. Let's see if this thing um, even includes any batteries. All right, as you can see, it takes batteries, but it can't just be some freaking clip-on thing. What the fuck, do you think I'm two years old? First of all, I don't think a kid's gonna be playing retro games. Ugh, not unless he's really weird. I mean, most kids play on their Xbox 360s or PlayStation 5s, you know? And of course, for 30 bucks, you get no batteries. It takes triple A. All right, got some batteries. I hope these are any good. Probably from an old remote or something. I don't know. Let's see what happens when I put these in here. Three bucks and can't even include batteries. What kind of fucking piece of shit is this? All right. All right, let's turn it on. What happens? Ooh, a nice blue LED. That's fancy. All right. Uh, let's go get an Android device and see if this actually works. All right, let's see if this works with my reflection in the freaking picture. Is there any way I can, ah, there we go. Turn on Bluetooth. All right. Anything happening? Da, 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 da. No nearby Bluetooth devices found. Oh great, the batteries are dead already. Oh, nope, it's doing something. Mm, scan for device. Oh, nope, it turned off again. I think something's getting returned to the store. The uh, phone cannot detect the device. So. There you go. That's 30 bucks. 8 bitty by iCade. Don't work. See? No nearby Bluetooth device found. Well, that was a uh, waste of 30 bucks. So, uh, there you go, folks. Happy gaming. Piece of shit. <laughs>